This is a mechanical fuel pump taken from a Piper Warrior aircraft, but it's typical of a mechanical fuel pump in most light aircraft. If the aircraft was a low wing design, then it would be supported with an electric fuel pump which would be used at appropriate times of flight. It fits into the engine block like that and this lift pump rocker arm is operated by an off-center cam, a lobe which presses down on it and it lifts a diaphragm in here. Let's take it apart and have a look inside. Now to demonstrate how this works, I'm going to have to place it into a vise to show you how, by rocking this arm, the diaphragm moves up and down. Now the cam lobe spins round and round here and it pushes down on this arm. And what it does is you can see how the diaphragm moves up and down. And that diaphragm moving up and down is going to suck fuel through a one-way check valve. As the diaphragm moves up, fuel is sucked via a filter through this aperture here, through the one-way check valve. As the diaphragm moves down, fuel cannot go this way, it can only go through this port here which also has a one-way check valve the opposite direction to this one and the fuel exits here and it's as simple as that this hole pump is usually fitted just in front of the firewall and you can see on the diagram to the left there where it's fitted on that particular engine that I'm showing you and just finishing off we look at this schematic for the DA40 and you can see the position of the mechanical fuel pump and that's supported with an electric fuel pump which is further downstream.